County families still without power right now and dealing with a lot of repairs days after rain fell on East Tennessee. You know, many of us experiencing flooding, uh, closed roads, even some storm damage. In fact, the Cheeks family sharing on Facebook that a nearby tree fell during Monday's storm, knocking down a utility pole, which in turn damaged the family's KUB meter. New at 5, WHE 6 on your side reporter Laura Holm getting a look at the mess Mother Nature made. I'm going to take all the equipment off of this pole. A broken power pole and down power lines in the Cheeks' front yard today. It broke at Plymouth at the base here. Just bam. The family says the storm Monday night caused a surprising chain reaction. That didn't even seem like that powerful of a storm to me. Sheila Cheek says the heavy rain caused this tree to fall on KUB lines, and the tension was strong enough to damage their metering pole. This is exactly how we found it. It's not been moved. The family says their insurance has deemed the damage an act of nature. We understand that's our pole, and we have KUB pole, too, and we have their lines and service, but the incident that happened across the street is what caused our problem. To me, that was no fault of ours. We woke up without with our lines on the ground. KUB says the homeowner is responsible for repairs when it's customer-owned equipment, which are the service bracket, weather head, service cables, metering pole, and meter socket. They will replace our meter if we get the pole set and get an electrician to put the box back on the pole and everything. From there, KUB crews will return to the home and restore power. In the meantime, the Cheeks are relying on a borrowed generator. So that's getting us a couple of lights, the TV, and the refrigerator going to keep our stuff from spoiling. Friends and neighbors are helping the Cheeks install a donated power pole to get things back to normal. I'm so excited to get my power back on. I'm excited, but and so grateful. I hope God blesses them tenfold. In Knox County, Laura Holm, WATE, six on your side. Oh, mm. people helping I'll people. See them stepping up. That's Love right. Love that. This is a great reminder, by the way. We want to see what the weather looks like where you are when a storm rolls through or the damage it leaves behind. You can always send us your pictures and videos by heading to our website, wate.com, and submitting them through the reported section. Happy to say.